Hello friends, welcome to our channel Knowledge Amplifier. So today in this particular video, I am going to discuss another very important concept related to Kafka and that is Kafka log segments. Okay, what is that? Let us try to understand, right? So in my previous video, I have already discussed in detail about Kafka logs, which is one of the most important part in our whole Kafka architecture. Basically, that is the place where all the messages are stored. So that plays a very vital role in producers and consumers communication via Kafka cluster, right? So if you want to know those detailed explanations, you can go through the link given in the description box. So let's try to understand what is log segment, okay? So as we already discussed that the messages, whatever producers are publishing in a topic in a Kafka cluster, those are basically stored within a particular log file inside a particular partition in a Kafka server in append manner, right? Like here, this particular picture is showing that producers are producing messages and that are keep on getting stored in a particular log file in append manner, right? Now, what happens that instead of creating one single large log file in a particular partition, what Kafka does that is, it creates several small, small files where all the messages are stored. Like for example, you can configure that if this much MB of data is stored in a single log file, the next messages will be stored in another new file. Okay, like that, multiple small, small log files will be created instead of having a bulk or a large log file. Okay, and those small, small files inside a particular partition in a particular server is called segment okay and what should be the segment size beyond which if the file size increases then it will be creating another segment that you can configure in your server properties i'll be showing you that no need to worry okay so you can consider the architecture in simple words like this way that here we are having our kafka cluster inside kafka cluster as you know that there can be multiple servers and inside servers, we can have multiple topics, okay? So you can consider like this way, inside Kafka cluster, we are having multiple topics. Here I have shown four, but it can be n number, not a problem, okay? Inside a particular topic, there is partitions and partitions are distributed across several servers in our Kafka cluster, right? So suppose we are having a topic A and that topic A has four partition, partition zero, partition one, partition two, and partition three, okay? Each partition, have multiple small small log files instead of a bulk big log file which is basically storing all the messages in append manner and those are called segments so here you can see multiple topics are there if you consider topic a what i displayed here it is having multiple partition if you consider one particular partition like partition zero here i have written the same that is having multiple segments inside it okay so segments are basically smallest unit where our data or the messages are stored okay multiple segments create one partition multiple partitions create a topic multiple topics are present inside kafka cluster that's the overview about the architecture or the hierarchy in data storage in kafka cluster okay so let's see how we can now play with the segment okay so what i will do i will go to my kafka which is present in my F drive. So this is a single node Kafka cluster. It will be having only single server. So here if I go inside config, here you will see server properties, okay? And you can change this one. Here if I go little bit below, here you will see this property. Log segment bytes, okay? What it is saying? The maximum size of a log segment file, when the size reaches the particular limit, or the following whatever we are mentioning in bytes then a new log segment will be created okay what i have discussed in theory same thing is written here so this log segment byte you can change so if the byte for our log file exceeds this particular amount then a new segment file will be created that's what is basically showing here for this particular demo i will change to a smaller value like for example thousand bytes okay so if for my case if a particular segment is exceeding the file size of 1000 bytes, a new segment file will be created, okay? That's the simple thing what I'm trying to say using these particular properties, right? I'll just save this, so our server properties is saved. And now here I am launching a fresh cluster. So if I go to zookeeper logs, nothing is there. If I go to server logs, nothing is there. And here you can see in zookeeper properties here, 
you can see I have configured the zookeeper logs directory and same like that way here in server properties also if you see here I have configured the log directory for server okay now how we can launch the process of launching is same first we will start our zookeeper okay so here I will go to PyCharm and I will paste the zookeeper code and I will hit an enter by default zookeeper will run in port 2181 so here you can see binding to port 0.0.0.0 .0 .0 .0 colon 2181 I will open another terminal and here I will start my Kafka server with the server properties what we have configured okay so currently for our case the segment threshold is basically 1000 bytes okay so if, if one particular block file is basically exceeding 1000 bytes a new segment will be created we will see that so here I will basically execute my server script okay let's execute that and here you can see that here our Kafka server is started okay and the port number is basically 9092 which is default port I will open a new terminal and here what I will do I will create a topic okay same code since beginning whatever I have discussed for this demo to make it very simple for you I am keeping replication factor as 1 and partition also 1 ok the topic name is hello world that's fine I will just paste that and I will hit an enter so here topic hello world is created ok now we no need to start the producer because producer we will basically create using our python code so here I am using the same python code what I discussed earlier Topic name we are putting bootstrap server for our case it is running in localhost 9092 and then here we are publishing 100 messages okay that's all we are doing here even I can start a consumer so I will open my command prompt and here I can start my consumer to show you the messages are also consumed so I will hit an enter and I will make my PyCharm window a little bit smaller Here is my producer side and here is my consumer side. So what I will do? I will run my Python code. Okay. So here you can see it started producing messages, and in the right hand side here we are having basically our consumer which has started consuming the messages. Okay. So we are publishing hundred messages. So up to ninety nine it is getting published because it started from zero, and that many number of messages only it is it has consumed. So earlier in our previous video we have seen only one single log file created because we had a sufficient good amount of volume in this configuration in log segment bytes and that much volume we were not generating that's why only one single in one single file if the messages were appending. Now here we reduce the amount of bytes for segmentation so currently we should see multiple small small log files created in our server logs okay. So let's go to Kafka logs then go to server logs here you will see consumer offset the default topic is created and here is hello world zero which is our topic okay right so I will just enter inside that and here you will see multiple log files so if I open my first log file which is this one here you will see that starting from number zero it is basically having till number 11 okay so zero to 11 it is we are having that is nearly approximately we can say uh, 12 records we are having okay so next partition should be having number 12 to approximately number 23 or 24 like that so let's see the next small file so here you can see it is started from number 12 and it went till here number 23 okay so next one will be approximately will be starting from number 24 and it will be going to 35 or 36 like next 11 or 12 records I can show you that so here you can see it started from 24 and it went up to 35 like that okay so like that in small small files our messages are getting stored and the only reason is this particular configuration that every time when one particular file when the messages are keep on appending if the file size is exceeding this much bytes a another file is getting created which is called segment okay so i hope the concept of segment is clear to you in kafka cluster and you can play with this one you, then you will be getting better feeling out of it 
hope you have understood this particular concept this is all for my this video if you find this video helpful then please like share and comment subscribe our channel if you are not subscribed till now and don't forget to press the bell icon to get the notification of our latest videos thank you